Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make a Lego Ezio Auditore from Assassin's Creed 2. Now, the first thing you'll need is a hood, and then red cape. It doesn't have to be red, neither does the hood. If you have paint, you could paint the hood. If you don't have a red cape, just use a regular kind of cape. It doesn't really matter. You'll need a person in white clothes, or if you don't have white clothes, just paint them white if you have paint. And so today, um, I'm going to show you how to get that, do that. See here, I've painted, I've painted his boots white, or painted the side of them silver, because of the armor he has in the game. Then the armor up here, the greaves, and then the metal chest guard, and then the spadlers. I forgot to paint the vambrays, but hopefully you won't forget. See, this was my first one I made, and it's not—it's not very good, but I think my my um my friends think it's cool. But anyway, so that's that. And here's some weapons. No, the hidden blade—that's tough. Um, I got this off of um Lego Monster Fighter set. I am. Um, it came with an extra claw. The wolf. This is the werewolf. So you cut these two pieces off right here and just have the metal one, then you just paint it silver if you have a silver paint. And that's the hidden blade. I'll show you what it looks like on him. Now you can put it on left or right, it doesn't really matter, but put it he has it usually on the left hand in his game. In the game. See this is what it looks at it looks like. Now if you have if you have two extra ones you could make two, but I didn't, so I had to make one. There's that. And then he has his sword. Just regular sword. I just got this from a minifigure, dark minifigure guy. I just painted the sword white silver. Then throwing knives. Then the dagger I got from a Prince of Persia set. I don't really play with it, so I just took this and I'm using that. Now, now the cape. See, if you want to, if you have a cape that's maybe like uh, let's say the size of a Batman cape, you just cut cut it in half and have this on the shoulder right here like he does in the game to cover hide his blade Let's see fix that there you go and um i also gave him a horse oh, the blade fell off i gave him a horse too so maybe get it it came with a little good castle set but i don't really play with it it's oh. a white horse right there it's kind of white now I know in the game that the lion sign is a Templar, but I just pretend that it's not there. Cause usually, um, as soon as I get a com camera and a computer, I'm gonna start making Lego stop motion it's with um, Ezio. And I have a obstacle course too that I'm gonna make him run through. So that's that. And if you don't have um, the wolf, the wolf claw like this to make the hidden blade for, you could either Cut it off of a sword and glue it onto his hand, or if you don't want to, you just or you can, or you just pretend he has one. Now I didn't make the hidden gun because that would have been hard to do. I would have that if you want to do that, you could cut off part of a gun. Let me see if I have one somewhere. Uh, well, you know, you just cut off a part of a gun, like gray handgun, and just glue it to the side of his hand right here, or whatever hand you want to do. So that's that, and um, if you need any help on making other Lego things, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching.